Oh, hey, how you doing? This is Sam from fitnessgurusam.com at fitconcepts.com. Today, I'm taking a stroll here in beautiful Sharon, Pennsylvania, my hometown. It is hot and humid here today because we're in the East Coast. It is about 85 degrees and humidity is really kicking and which brings me up to a great subject and that is hydration. You know, summer months are approaching and it's very important for us to stay hydrated if we are doing any kind of activity, especially outside and if we're going to be outside in any uh, pro prolonged period of time. Now, we know that water is essential for every physiological process in our body. That's right, every physiological process in our body depends on water. So we need plenty of water to make sure that our body is functioning properly, is getting rid of waste, and is helping us achieve our fitness goals as well. Now, you know, um, it's true that as we age, our body water decreases, and that's just a fact. That's why they always tell you to bring the elderly home when it's really hot, because they're already kind of in a dehydrated state, okay? So if you are older, kind of make sure that you know you're not, you know, outside a prolonged period of time, and spe um, you know, uh, pay special attention to your hydration level. And if you're young, even make sure that you keep drinking water all the time. And that's especially important if you're an athlete playing football or baseball outside. You know, just make sure you keep hyd keep hydrated. Now, a lot of my clients ask me, do we need those sport drinks? Or do we need like things like Gatorade or Powerade and things like that? My answer to that is depends. Now, if you're an endurance athlete or if you're going to be playing outside for, you know, four, five, six hours, or you're going to be, you know, bicycling outside or playing baseball or football outside for, for long periods of time, then it's probably a good idea to have a something like Gatorade or Powerade or some sports drink that has some minerals in it, has some sugar in it for you to be able to work out and get through your workout and not cramp up. Now, if you're going to be working out and your main concern is to lose body fat, you know, and you're going to be going to a, you know, an air conditioned gym, you know, you know, one of those big box gyms or to my gym, then it's not really not necessary to have like Power 8 or Gatorade or any of those sports drinks because the sugar in those drinks usually delay, not usually, they do delay the fat burning process. Because we gotta remember, sugar is a primary source of energy for your body. And as long as you have sugar in your body, then your body's not gonna burn any body fat because sugar is the preferred source of energy. Now, conclusion to this is that if you are, you know, going to be outside in any period of time, oh, barely dropped the water. You know, if you are going to be working out outside, you know, for periods of long periods of time, then make sure you stay hydrated. Might not be a bad idea for, you know, some sports drinks. But for the fat burning process, if you try to you know drop a few pounds, especially those last bit of pounds, then definitely, definitely you want to stay away from you know sugars and, and anything like that. This is Sam from fitnessgurusam.com and fitconcepts.com. Thank you so much for tuning in. We're in beautiful Sharon, Pennsylvania, and we'll come and see you soon. Bye-bye.